Hey, Bougie. Come here, check this out. What's that? Okay. Check these pictures out. Were they wild? Oh my god. Oh my god, what's this? They're orbs. Wow. Yeah, it's spooky. Look at this little things over here, like it looks like medallions with spooky faces on it. <laughs> <laughs> they do. Like, like a ghost, they look like spooky know? faces, don't they? Yeah. Look at this, look like a ugly little person inside that little circle. They're orbs. They're floating orbs. They actually look like ghosts. They look like God, look, look at that at one. That one. That's freaky, man. That really look like ghosts. Ooh. There's so many of them, there's thousands of them. Yeah. Look at that one. Wow. Where did you get that from? Joey from Long Island sent me these pictures. I just got the letter today. Yeah. That's pretty scary. I can't believe we are going like tomorrow. <laughs> We're going to be walking around in these woods. Oh my god. I don't know. I don't know. It's Hopefully we'll be able scary. to get some of these pictures. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. I can't wait. I can't wait either. <laughs> Hold on, babe. Hello? Hey, Mike. How's it going? I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. Thanks for asking. Yes, we're looking forward to seeing you. We're going to be up on the 15th. 12 o'clock is a good time, Mike. That's a perfect time for us. I'm coming with my girlfriend, Bougie. <laughs> yes, Bougie's her name. Bougie. <laughs> yeah, she's looking forward to meeting you. The weather is beautiful here today. It's so sunny and awesome. The Huntington Diner. I'm sure we'll find it, Mike. We have GPS, yes. Perfect, perfect. Yes, we look forward to meeting you as well. And I'll call you when we get in. Thanks, Mike. Thanks for calling. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye for now. Okay, thank you, Mike. Bye-bye. Who was that, babe? That's like I'm Mike Gallagher. Uh, I remember, that's the historian you told me about. That's the dude that knows all about Mount Misery Road. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, that's cool. I know, it's very exciting. I can't wait. So you set an appointment for tomorrow, yeah? Yeah, we're going to have some lunch with him. Yeah, that's really cool, babe. But why don't you come over here? I have so many articles online that I found. And maybe you can take a look at that. It just looks like it's one after another. It's Everything is about Mount Misery. Look at that. Look at that. Haunted road trip, one of Long Island creepiest places. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And here, ghost, crazy Mary, who is that? The woman in white, look at this. Check this one out, New York's dangerous dead end road. Oh shit, isn't it scary? <laughs> oh my god. What's this one? Folklore, tales, legends, myths. Huntington's own spirits that still roam the old hill. Oh my god, that's a lot of things over here. Check that out. Oh my god, check these pictures. <laughs> oh my god, that's spooky. That's scary, babe. That creature's <laughs> really scary, though. Look at that. Look at this one. Oh my god, that's creepy. It looks like a beast, like a like a black creature with the red eyes glowing. Look at that. That's the Mothman beast that, that, that supposedly lives in the woods. Oh my god, that's ugly. Oh. Ugly motherfucker. Oh my god, it's creepy looking. Oh, oh my god. Ugh. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Look at those pictures of this guy's eyes, man.
those ugly red eyes. Be a lot of girls in the Mount Misery Road, <laughs> and I wouldn't run to, to any of them. Babe, you know I'm going to be filming you in the woods, and me in the woods. We're going to be looking at orbs yeah. and ghosts, and I'm going to try to document everything. Yeah, I know, I know, <laughs> I know. Are you up for that or what? Well, I let you do whatever you want with your camera. You know, it's it's okay. You know, <laughs> it's okay. you're going to be my little ghost hunter. <laughs> oh my God. Are you ready for that or what? <laughs> It's gonna be a lot of fun. I guess, yeah. Hey, but you wanna celebrate that? You wanna go with me and check out some lunch places in the town? Yeah, why don't we go have a drink somewhere? Yeah, yeah, okay. Is that all right? Yes, yes. Okay, let me kiss. Sexy. I love dancing for you, babe. I love when you dance for me. It's awesome. I love it. Are you excited that we're going to Mount Misery Road tomorrow? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> I can't wait for that. We're going to have a great time. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. You want to sit down and get some food? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's have some food. I'm hungry. Okay. I'm starving. Great specials here today, you know. I come here many years ago. It's the first time I've been back here in a while. They got shrimp on Tuesday nights, they got Monday well, nights. Got... I didn't want to be rude, but I thought I overheard you talking about Mount Misery Road. Yeah. That's on Long Island. That's where I'm from. It's Huntington. Really? Really. <laughs> Interesting. What a coincidence. We're actually going up there tomorrow. We've been planning our trip for months now, and we're, we have this thing about ghosts and orbs. Really? And, uh, we're looking to see if we can find some in the woods over there at Mount Misery Road. Uh, why don't you sit down? Sure. I'm Charlie. I'm Kurt. This is Bougie. Hi, Bougie. Hey, hey, Kurt. So, um, I'm interested. Uh, what can you tell me about Mount Misery Road? Well, Mount Misery Road uh, got its name from the uh, settlers that were trying to you know, take their wagons up the slopes and on the rocky road. And so they named it Mount Misery Road. <laughs> Interesting. Tell me more. There were rumors of strange lights in the sky and sightings in the sky also. There's a, uh, a sighting of a hellhound or a man beast creature 
that roams those hills with red glowing eyes. You believe this person? Really? Yeah, that's creepy. It's definitely creepy. Yeah, it is. What else, Kurt? Then in the 1840s, there was an asylum built on the top of the hill for the insane. They kept the insane in the asylum because that was the only way they could treat them back then. There was a patient named Mary. Somehow she started a fire in her room and the fire burned down the asylum, killing all the workers and all the patients. No way. Yes. What a crazy bitch. My yeah. God. And then 10 years later, they built another asylum on the same spot. But three months later, after that asylum was finished, it burned to the ground also. Are you kidding me? No. I can't. That's the legend of that area? That's really? That's the legend. That's a coincidence. Wow. That's, that's very fascinating. And it's been said that they can still smell the burning building or uh, hear the screams of the victims in the woods. You believe that, Bush? That's scary. It is creepy. Go on, tell us more. There's been many instances of mutilated bodies and slaughtered animals found in those woods. The local residents think that it's the work of the man beast, the hellhound that roams those woods to this day. That beast with those red glowing eyes? Red glowing eyes. Huh. Babe, hey, that's the beast that we saw on that computer. Ew. Oh my God, that thing's ugly. So that thing's still in the woods, you think, today? That's what they say. Really? How do you know this? Well, I read the reports about this that uh, when I researched Mount Misery Road. Huh. And that was mentioned about the Mandy's the creature, the hellhound. Well, from all that I've told you, my suggestion would be to stay away from Mount Misery Road. It's considered one of the most haunted places in America. There's been people that have gone into the woods and that they never saw them again. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're going up there tomorrow and, and uh, we're really, really excited about this trip. With all the shit that's been going on there that I've told you about, the, uh, the white lady with the robe and the mutilated bodies and the slaughtered animals, it's not a safe place. You have no business going there. What are you going there for? The reason why we're going up there is that we are ghost enthusiasts. We like going to haunted places to see if we could find orbs and ghosts. We like ghosts, right? <laughs> well, I'm warning you, stay away from Mount Misery Road. That land is cursed. You and your girlfriend can go into those woods and never be seen again. It's haunted. What would you and your girlfriend uh, want to be in there? Okay, Kurt, I, I really appreciate what you're telling us. Um, you know, we've been planning this trip for months, and it's, it's taken us a while to get this trip and the money together to do it. So, you know, we're even meeting with a local historian named Mike Gallagher. The guy's well-known in that area. We've already confirmed the appointment. He called us today. So we can't back out now. It's just too much time invested in this, too much money invested in it. And we're going to go. You know, we're looking forward to seeing if we can find some, some orbs and you know, ghosts in the woods. I can't wait to go there. She's excited. I'm excited. So we're, we're really not going to back out. We're, we're, we're not going to cancel our trip. You should listen to what I'm saying to stay away from there. You don't need to go there because it's a very haunted place. I'm warning you, stay away from Mount Misery Road. That's cursed land. You and your girlfriend can go up there to those woods and go in and never be seen again. So I would say stay away. Stay away from Mount Misery Road. You have no business being there. It's cursed land.
babe, what do you think about that guy in the bar tonight? Is he for real? Weird though. Trying to scare us, spook us. Before he even went into those woods. He actually pissed me off. Telling us that land is cursed. It's full of shit. <laughs> yeah, that guy was drunk. I think he was out of his mind. And I think he wanted to scare us on purpose and make us paranoid. So we cancelled our trip. Why? Are you scared, baby? Are you scared? No. <laughs> no. Are you sure? <laughs> scared? I'm not scared. Actually, I can't wait to go to this woods tomorrow, babe, and see some ghosts. Me too. We're gonna have a great time. Yeah. Babe, let's go to bed now. It's getting late. All right. We have a busy day tomorrow. We gotta get up early. I know. Sounds good.
Delayed flights to get to here, to New York. Oh my god. Hey. Good morning. Uh, good morning. Good morning, Bougie. Good morning. Good morning. You're filming me? No. <laughs> we have a beautiful day today. Mount Misery Road, here we come. Oh, yeah, today. Oh, my God. Yeah. Are oh, you excited? I'm so excited. Oh, my God. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. So why don't you get up and take a shower so we can get ready? Yeah. told me yesterday that you're gonna film me and the whole trip and I think I decided that I'm gonna assist in that and I'm gonna be a little ghost hunter <laughs> really that's awesome babe it's gonna be so exciting let's go Yeah, Bushi. You know, I'm so excited. I can't wait to meet that historian guy that you told me about. Like, it's gonna be a great meeting. Yeah, Mike is a great guy. Very knowledgeable about the Mount Misery Road area. Yeah. He's a great historian. He's yeah. gonna probably educate us a lot today. We're gonna have so much fun, oh my god. I know, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. <laughs> Let's go. Freezing outside. Very cold up here. We just came in from Florida. As you know, 
and I just want to thank you for meeting us. And I came to see if I could pick your brain apart a little bit about a book that you did back in the 80s uh, about Mount Misery Road. You can ask me a few questions, but I'm going to tell you right off the bat that I don't do these interviews anymore. The only reason that I came here today, I just felt responsible to tell you that you need to stay away. This is an incredibly dangerous place. There have been people who disappeared, probably died in those woods over the last decades. And I, I just feel you should just find another place to take your vacation. Um, we were going to go there during the day and basically see if we can find some orbs, some pictures of maybe some ghosts. I heard that the Mothman is in there jumping from trees. There's been sightings of this Mothman. Um, in your book, you've written about the asylum. Uh, we're trying to see if we can find a foundation there, the old asylum. Um, maybe we can see Mary floating through the woods during the day. Do you know how many times I've talked to people about these things over the years? Seriously, you are wasting my time getting me up here on a freezing Saturday morning. These things, whether they exist or not, I don't know. I've spent decades of my life chasing these things, these things you're talking about, these mothmen and Mary. There are all kinds of accounts. The only thing, the only thing that's factual is a statistically high number of people have died or disappeared. I don't even know if they've died. I just know they're gone, they've vanished. I'm here to tell you that I want to wash my hands of this. I don't want to talk to people about this anymore. I don't want to draw people to this area. I don't want any more people to die. Okay, Mike, I, I really appreciate what you tell us. I really respect that. Um, I was curious about the, the asylum, uh, Mary in the Woods, the old asylum that burned down many years. And we, we've heard stories of a hellhound with these red glowing eyes that lives in the woods. Just don't go into those woods. So what you're saying, it's a very dangerous place to go. It's extremely dangerous, in my opinion. Extremely dangerous. Um, you have to be a certain level of stupid to walk in there at this point after everything I've told you. Don't do it. What could happen if we go in there at night? You never know who's going to come after you. Oh, it's cold out there. Yeah. So what are you thinking? I, I don't know. He was very negative on us going down to Mount Misery. I know. That wasn't really a good good meeting. I thought it was going to be better. I know. It's kind of scary. I mean, I don't feel good about it anymore. What are we doing? Uh, well, we came all the way from Florida, so we might as well go, go down there and check it out. We're here. <laughs> are you sure? <laughs> yeah, I think we should do it. We came all the way from Florida to do this, so let's make it happen. All right. All right, then. Well, I want to see some ghosts anyway. <laughs> well, that's what we came here for. <laughs> Babe, as we drive through these woods, you know this is the highest point on Long Island. And all these houses that are built by these people today, these houses are basically built on cursed land. And the people probably don't even know it. Somewhere around here is this old inn. This is it. Wow, I can't believe you found it. This place looks spooky. Look at the windows, they're very creepy looking. Wow, this place looks very, very spooky. I read about this story though, about these two children. Supposedly they went missing. 
and the townspeople would actually come here and sit around the fireplace talking how they're going to have a search to find these children. As the weeks went by, they went searching through the woods over here at Mount Misery, and they finally found the children. They found the mutilated body parts scattered all throughout the hills. They actually buried the kids in the old cemetery downtown on Main Street in Huntington. Wow, look at the windows. If they can only speak. I can't believe we're here. Mount Misery Road. I can't believe we're here. So we're gonna search for this mental hospital today. Yes, we we're gonna try to find the house hospital that was built in the 1700s for okay. the crazy insane. That's gonna be adventure today. Yeah, we're gonna go through the woods and see if we can get a chance to see the old asylum. See if we can find the foundation. Wow, this is a Mount Misery. Yeah, this is the where the road starts. Right over here is where the road starts where the wooded areas are past these tree over here. Yeah. Babe, this is the Mount Misery Road that we finally came to. I know. We so. finally are here. I, I'm, <laughs> I'm blown away from Florida to New York to Long Island to Mount Misery Road. We've been waiting for this for months. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Mothman has been seen in these woods. During the day, Mothman has been seen. There's been sightings. People that were just walking their dogs had seen Mothman jumping from trees. Just amazing. So hopefully today we'll get a chance to see if we can see Mothman. <laughs> and at night, people have seen the Hellhound. People have found that dog. They have seen that dog with those glowing eyes. It's just amazing that we're here. So today what we're going to do, babe, is we're going to see if we can find the asylum. We're gonna see if we can find the old remnants, the old foundation, and see if we can see where it was. Okay, Supposedly that's cool. there's Mary in the woods somewhere. Well, I don't wanna see that. Oh, that would be great if we finally see it. That would be awesome. No, I Are don't. Are you sure? No, Come I don't on. wanna see that. It'll be fun. We're gonna take a lot of pictures today and we're gonna see that's if we crazy. can uh, get a chance to see some ghosts and maybe later when it gets dark, we'll see if we can find some orbs. You're crazy. Come on, babe, let's go. Yes. Look, there's a snow here. Oh my God. Can you believe that? Wow, we, we don't, don't have, have snow like this in Florida. No, we don't, no. Oh my God, that's pretty cool. I've never seen snow, it's amazing. No, I've seen snow, <laughs> but it's really cool. Okay, so let's see if we can find the remnants of the asylum. There have been a lot of sightings around here and everything. That's the I can't believe this. We're here. We came all the way from Florida to see this. <laughs> wow, this is the top of the, the mountain. This is it. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> it seems like there's nobody but us here. I know, the place looks empty. I guess we're the only people here. Yeah, there's not even one person walking. 
Babe, give me the camera. I want to film you now. Wow, check that ravine out. Oh my gosh. Check this out over here. Look at this. Oh my god, it goes down. This is why they call it Mount Misery Road. Look at this ravine. Wow. I try to get a wagon train coming up this, this valley here. Forget it. That's spooky. It's very spooky. <laughs> hey, babe. Hey, babe. <laughs> hey, babe. Hey. It's cold, man. It's I know. Cold here today. I know. Ooh. I know. Well, let's go up this way over here, babe. Come on. Oh my god, babe, look! Look across! Oh shit! Wow, a black cross in the woods! Oh shit! Oh my god, that's creepy! That's <laughs> definitely creepy, man. Maybe that's a warning. That's creepy! Let's get out of here. Babe. Oh, okay. Wow. Oh my god, what is that? Isn't that part of that hospital? The thing? Yes, it could be part of the oh asylum. My god. Yes. Like one of the posts, Look the wood posts. Here. Look at here. It's amazing. It's all like, you know, made Wow, it's cool that you found that. Wow, yeah. Let's go find some more stuff. I'm right behind you, Bougie. <laughs> Bougie, it's got to be here in these woods. Yeah, I know. Just been walking for like two hours right now. There's nothing. The maps say it's in this area. I can't believe we can't find it. I hope we're going to find something today. It's got to be around here somewhere. Be careful. Yeah. Oh my god, babe, what's this? Can you see that? Oh shit. Whoa, whoa, that looks like an wow. outcropping of foundation stones. Wow. Wow. Oh my, oh my god. god. Oh my god. Oh my god, look at that. It looks like it could be pieces of the asylum. That's the foundation of the hospital. I'm sure. Oh wow. That's so cool. That's gotta be pieces of the asylum. Oh god. It looks like a foundation of the hospital of asylum. You know that's exactly what I think it is. Yeah. It's gotta be. Look at that over there. Look, there's more of it over oh there. I mean, that looks like the front entrance or something. It was like it was here. See that? Look at this. Look at this. Look. It looks like a... Like a burn. Is there some marking? There's a marking over there as well. Yes. In the cement. Here? Yes. Look, look. I'm sure it means something. Wow. Wow, I can't believe this. It's amazing. It looks like it's burnt. It's burnt, right? Huh. Wow. That's awesome, babe. Woo! That looks like a burnt mark. I mean, we're looking for all this time. Let's see oh what else God. we can find. Okay. Babe, I'm getting tired. Do you have a reception on your phone? No, the reception doesn't work here. I just checked it a second ago and it doesn't work. Shit. I hope you know the way back. I don't want to get lost. Well, I'm sure we'll be able to get out of here somehow. Okay, 
shall we? Yeah, Bushi. Can I ask you something? Yeah, what's up? Um, I have a question because I heard that in the woods, you know, like when there was a fire in that hospital building, there was some woman and she was really depressed and obsessed and I don't know what's going on with that woman, but do you know anything about it? Like, what was her name? Anything? Yeah, her name was Mary. Mary was the psycho. She okay. was the crazy girl, supposedly, that she burned all the people in the hospital. There no! Oh my God! 25 patients burned with her, or supposedly she got out and she survived. But uh, the, the whole thing behind Mount Misery is that she is seen in the woods walking. This is, you know, no. from two, three hundred years ago. She's seen in the woods still walking? She, supposedly she wears a white hospital robe. And oh she God. has this ghostly appearance. And she hovers or lurks in the woods. And Are you serious? Oh my God. And there's been screams and howls and moans from other patients that walk the woods and supposedly oh people have seen them around the area here. I can't hear that anymore, you know, are you serious about it? She's like walking around like that, like the ghost, like a real ghost. Oh my God, I want to get out of here, but uh, I mean, uh, let's get out of here. I, I'm really, uh, I'm really scared. I, I got to remember where we are though first. I don't know where we are. I, I don't know, this, this is dull, this is dull. All right, hold on, I, we got to get our bearings straight here because I don't know where we are. We might get lost now. We went deep into the woods here. Hold behind me, okay? Oh my I don't know if we're going the right way though, babe. I think this doesn't look Let's familiar. Go. Let's go. Come on. Hey, slow down. Where are you no, going? Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I want to get out of here. Let's go. Everything's okay. Let's go. Hurry up, Charlie. Come on. Bougie, relax. I don't want to be here anymore. I think we're getting lost, but I, I think, let's see if we can find our way back. Okay. Well, walk behind me, okay? I'm following you. Okay. Don't leave me here. Hey, babe. Babe. Yeah, babe, what's up? I need to go to the bathroom. No, really? <laughs> All right, I'll just stay here. I'm okay. going to look around with the camera okay. Okay. and just see around and take a okay. look. Okay. Just try to go behind the tree over there if you can. Okay, I will. All right, I'll be right here. just amazing. I feel like somebody's looking at me and watching me. Why am I getting this feeling? What's going on here? Something's happening. The woods. Something's going on in these woods. Let me see what's happening over here. Just so weird. Oh my 
Where are you? You said you're not gonna leave me here. Oh my god. What am I gonna do right now? Charlie! Charlie! Oh my god. Okay, okay. I'm gonna get it together. Calm down. Okay, calm down. Calm down. It's gonna be okay. I just gotta go through this woods. Okay, I'm gonna just go. And it's gonna be alright. I'm gonna find a way out. Okay. Okay, it's good. Okay, I'm going.
just want to get out of here. I just want to get out of here. Where is everybody? Where is Charlie? Where are you, babe? Babe? Babe, please help me. Please help me. Anybody help me? What the fuck are those? Fuck. I have to get up. I have to. I have to get up. There is someone. There is somebody watching me. Yeah. I feel there is somebody behind my back. There is somebody behind my back. Oh my God. Oh my God.
So what's important about this map is that it shows you all the, the, the um, Native American tribes that lived in the area. It was not always called Mount Misery. Find that out, we're going to have to spend days in here. These are government records. Again, these are records, you know, from the different departments. Yeah, these are, these are the permanent records of the town of Huntington. What we have in here is from 1660, 1653.